I don't really have shit to talk about. I think my biggest accomplishment recently is uh, <laughs> I finally went out and bought myself uh, a grocery bag. Um, <laughs> I was against it. I wasn't going to do it, but I, I, I had to. I, I found out the hard way. Um, went to the grocery store. They got rid of plastic bags. I didn't know. I guess they sent out an email or something. <laughs> and I missed it, because I just don't check my email. So I go to the grocery store, I buy a shitload of groceries, I get to the checkout, and the cashier said to me, would you like bags for your groceries? <laughs> I was like, that's the only way I'm going to get this shit to the car. <laughs> She replied, how many bags would you like? <laughs> as many as it'll take to get this shit to the car. Why are you asking me all these questions? You talking like the bag boy's not standing right here in front of us. That is his expertise. You should talk to him. And I turned to the bag boy like, you need to speak up for yourself. You're never going to move up at the rate you're going. So they offer you brown paper bags if you, you know, you know, you had to pay for those. And the cashier was like, how many, you know, it'll, it'll be 10 cents a piece. And I was like, for what? She was like, the bags. And I was like, fuck that shit. Put it in my arms. I'll carry all this shit to the car. She was like, that's a lot of groceries. I said, yes, I'm well aware of that. That's why I plan the double bag by putting both arms under this shit. <laughs> and made 15 trips back and forth to my car. <laughs> now I got a bag and I don't even use it because I forget it at the house. <laughs> a buddy of mine says to me a couple of weeks ago, you look like you lost weight. I was like, yeah, I only bought one grocery bag. <laughs> By the time I put milk and water in there, there's no room for shit else. So. 